Yo, 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 what's good, y'all? It's your boy Fro in the building. And today, I'm going to be talking about one of my favorite movies of all time. The 1999 film, The Hurricane, starring Denzel Washington. Ain't nothing to it, but to do it. I think this is yet another underrated turn from Denzel. He got the Golden Globe and an Oscar nomination, but I feel that not many people talk about this movie as they should. This one's based on a true story. Denzel plays Reuben Carter, a boxer who goes to jail for a crime that some people say he committed or some people say he's innocent. This movie goes down the Reuben Carter was innocent route. Now, what are my personal thoughts? I don't know. I was not there. I'm 25 years old. Long time ago, this case happened. But I'm reviewing this as a film, and it's one of my favorites ever. Denzel as Ruben is a phenomenal performance. We get to see his anger, his frustration behind bars. He's very adamant, and he's pleading with how innocent he is. He writes a book, and a young man named Lesra comes across it while he's at a book drive, I believe. Lesra's staying in Canada with three cool white folks. They're played by Lee Schreiber, John Hanna, and Deborah Kara Unger. Vicious Rion Shannon, who plays Lesra, does a great job. He cares a bunch for Reuben Carter, pretty much looks at him as a fatherly figure, and he eventually decides that he wants to help Reuben get out of prison. So he convinces the three Canadian folks that he's living with to help him out. And this movie turns into a great story with these folks trying to help Ruben while Ruben is battling with himself behind bars. There's some fantastic scenes where Denzel's going all out. One comes to mind where he's literally talking to himself, three versions of himself in a cell, and Denzel is just bodying this fucking scene. Top five Denzel moment. This movie does jump around a bit sometimes, showing flashbacks with how Ruben was boxing and scenes of Ruben's childhood that's pretty rough. I love how the one or two boxing scenes are shot. I think the cinematography in this whole movie is excellent. Costume design is great. I think everybody looks fresh in this film, especially in the flashback scenes. I'm blanking out on the character's name, but Dan Hedaya plays the bad guy in this film. He plays the main bad detective going after Ruben. Della Pesca, that's the character's name. Dan Hedaya does a great job playing such a slime ball. Always love Rod Steger as the judge near the end of the film. It was pretty much a, yeah, I'm on the clock, I'm acting, what do you want from me performance? But it fits so well with the judge in this movie. And he's the one that gets Ruben out of jail. The music score by Christopher Young is phenomenal. It's a 10 out of 10. It's one of my very, very, very favorite scores ever. Racial motivation, hate put me in prison, love is going to bust me out. I highly recommend that people listen to the score for Hurricane. Outstanding work from Christopher Young. And before I move on, another very strong Denzel moment is when he's with the lawyers near the end and they're talking behind the screen and Ruben says, I've been locked up for 30 years. And he pretty much snaps. He says, get me out of here. Just a great fucking moment. And the John Artist stuff is pretty sad too, how it's done in the film. John Artis was the guy that got arrested alongside Ruben, who goes to prison as well. I love the scene with Ruben and Lesra near the end of the film before the final verdict. Ruben pretty much feels like this is the last hurrah, but he's at peace with it if he doesn't win. Lesra's like, no, fuck that. I'm going to bust you out of here. I thought it was a really sweet scene. But overall, one of my favorite movies ever. Fantastic 10 out of 10 music score. Great writing, great dramatic moments, great cast, very likable characters, a dynamite performance from Denzel, my favorite actor of all time. I'm going to give The Hurricane a 10 out of 10. Thank you all for watching. It's been your boy Fro Thizzle. Until next time, hit that subscribe button if you want more Fro Nerdy Talk. Peace.